The reasons that is related to the web-based um, software is because I realize that now today um, IT play important role in um, business and students when they have to prepare themselves to own their own business uh, or to work with other organizations around the world they have to be able to handle all their information they have to know the concept what is the central database and how I can have my student to understand the concept I have to tell them uh, what will be the idea of how they do the business in one single database and after tell them the uh, concept and then I show them how IT can help them to ease or their operation in the business and so we uh, choose the simulation from uh, well-known, the leading uh, well-known uh, IT software so the student can close to the business when they go out and uh, they graduate and they will know that uh, this kind of software is available uh, to them and how they choose to select to use them to avoid failures. ERP comes from uh, enterprise resource planning and it is a concept and also a software solution for business to integrate uh, different processes such as um, procurement, um, marketing, um, fulfillment, um, raw material, how to process different steps for the business activity into one single database and instead of looking at business as different department like marketing department, um, procurement department. We want the student to look at the business as process. No matter where um, which departments come from, you have to see through from um, the beginning how material go into the process. So um, different departments have to work together and the student will look at the business in the process view instead of uh, functional view. When they talk about um, procurement, they have to look at uh, warehouse will be related, um, accounting will be related, um, customer service will be related. So instead of working as a functional de different department, you have to work together and looking at the process uh, as a new way of um, doing the business. This way, information will be the same. No matter which department uh, enter the information, it will go into the single database and uh, the business will be able to track uh, how many customers we have, how many order we have, when the um, product will be delivered, uh, what will be the bottleneck uh, during the process. And so the software will come and help uh, the business to integrate all the information technology into one single database. I would um, introduce them to know about the concept of um, database first. And then uh, half of the course, we will have the student to have hand-on experience with the software. And I also find, find out from research that we need to have group activities for um, the student to learn how to work as a team and how they can assign different roles for their friends. So not only the software, but also uh, class activity are implemented in the course. Since we have to use the software to have the student know that the content that we use are also up to date, and we use the um, current um, IT equipment that allow them to be able to understand the concept and be able to understand once they go out into the real business. We also measure uh, how we can teach them and still maintain their satisfaction because all the creativities from the student will come 
as a result if they're satisfied with the content of the course. And so um, I measure uh, what would be uh, different factors contributed to the student satisfaction for the course, for the instructor, and how we can um, adjust um, how we operate the course to, to keep up with that uh, level of satisfaction. Um, there are different um, research related to um, the national student group and the Thai group. Uh, the result indicate that uh, Thai group tend to have a higher achievement and maybe somehow they're more satisfied with uh, the use of the web-based ERP simulation. Uh, one of the reasons may be because the students come from um, computer business major. They love to use the IT. They want to know how the content of the course can implement with all the IT equipment. For example, when we use the software, I would allow the student to use tablet, PC, to use smartphone, to be able to access into the web-based simulation. And so the students are excited to use the content that they can use with all their IT equipment. Nevertheless, students uh, who are in the national group, one of the reasons that the result may be, um, they, may, they may have a lower achievement, they may have a slightly satisfied with the course because they are afraid of the IT. It's very interesting to see that when you teach a group of students, Although they're using all this social network uh, site, Facebook, um, Twitter, whatever, but they are afraid to use the equipment, the IT equipment that available for academic content. So they may be afraid that they don't understand some of the content and if they wrongly use it, it will result in their role grade. So I would encourage the student to, to try and learn from the error that if they uh, use different screen, they click wrong in different button, it's okay as long as they try. And so whatever the result come out, we will try to figure out how to, how to solve the problem because that's how we want them to, to learn. So I would suggest uh, the teacher who implemented the web-based uh, ERP simulation to try to have activity that can have them to learn in group. I come up with the result that maybe for Bangkok University, we know that our goal is to uh, have the student to specialize in being entrepreneurship. So if we want a software like ERP to implement it in our curriculum, we should wait until the software uh, is produced for entrepreneurship. Currently, all the major ERP software produced for the last size organization. I think maybe around this year, uh, the software that fit for entrepreneurship uh, will come out because all the major ERP leading software they already know that there are potential, there are opportunity for entrepreneur businesses that they want to go global, but they don't want to have a last size uh, investment. They own their own business, they have um, worker employee for about 10 people. They have um, fewer product uh, type, but they want to go global. So um, the technology is coming for entrepreneurship is go to this trend.